one welcome friends and if you are using spring boot for your application building and you are using spring security and you are getting a page like this and you don't know what is the username and what is the password then this video is for you you can get help from this video that what is the username and password so friends let me show you how you add spring security so you have to just add this dependency in your application uh, spring boot starter security and you can add this uh, dependency from here edit starters uh, it will take time uh, here it is mm, you can see i have used uh, spring security if you untick this then uh, Spring Security will get removed from my project. But uh, if I tick this, Spring Security get added. So how can you find this Spring Security? You can just uh, search it here, Spring Security. And here you will find Spring Security and just tick it and uh, tick OK. So I have already added this, so I just cancel it. So you can see, uh, we get uh, this dependency here in our form.xml so friends uh, when we start this application we put a page like this and we don't know uh, what is the username and what is the password so from where we can get this we uh, get this from here uh, when we start application uh, our console will be look like this here it is when we start our application, uh, we can see uh, something like this happen before starting. And uh, here you can see the name is default. And, 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 and here it is the password. Uh, this is our password. So I just copy it. And, uh, let me show some uh, wrong credential like I just uh, added enter username and default and password like anything and you can see bad credential so I uh, now I will paste the same password which I copied from there and the name was default so I just did it and still it shows bad credential because the name is not default name is user so when I uh, enter user and enter password from what I have copied from there, so it just make login to me. So it it's my application. So skip it. So I have shown you how to enter in Spring Security, and you can get uh, your password and username from here, and you can change your uh, password and username. So uh, you can configure from database um, what is your username, what is your password. That was the stuff of later of onwards. So in, uh, initially you will get like this. So you can add Spring Security password and username. From here. So thanks for watching. If you do like, if you like my video, so to share it subscribe my channel and do like it thanks for watching